Hey there! I recently made a post over on my YouTube community page, and all my other socials, introducing a very special character to me. This is Yoki. She's my fursona slash true-sona, and I've actually had her for a little while. I made her back in September 2020, but I've kept her a secret because, well, everyone knows me online as Kona. I mean, all the stills I use in my videos have been with Kona. I've literally called her my fursona in posts, and that's because she was my fursona. But over time, I started to kind of lose my connection to Kona as a fursona. And I made Yoki one day with the intentions of drawing a character that was just a little more me. And when I drew Yoki for the first time, I have to say, I fell in love with her. She just felt a lot more me, and overall, I think her design is just... It's better. <laughs> and I'm going to be having her as my main Sona, and the character that represents me online from now on. And I know you're probably wondering what's going to happen to Kona. Well, she's definitely not going away, she's just going to be more of the mascot for my channel. See, there's Chloe Hatler, the YouTube channel, and then there's Chloe Hatler, who is me. Kona represents the channel, and Yoki represents me. I think that's a pretty good way of thinking about it. But in that case, I'll need some new stills. There we go! <laughs> I know this video may seem a little random, but I wanted to make it just to explain why you'll be seeing Yoki stills in my future videos, rather than Kona stills. I just like to keep you all clued in on the things that happen on this channel. Like and subscribe, and thanks so much for watching.